Hey, good morning, everybody. It's a Friday and Courtney and I are out on the road and where would we rather be than here in Eden this morning for the four day Eden Corn Festival, which has already begun. And Courtney, we're gonna have a great morning. We've got a lot about corn to talk to you oh, about. Oh yes, we do. And what a great way to end the week. Yes, perfect. Here in Western New York, out in Eden. This is my first time at the Eden Corn Festival. And I'm telling you, this is quite an event. Yes. Right when we got here, festival organizer, we'll tell you about him in just a little bit. He took us around in the golf cart, just kind of Wonderful. showing everything that they're gonna have in store for you. And of course, corn. I mean, that's the highlight of the weekend, A right? lot of corn. I, I think they go through something like 60,000 ears of corn just to get through uh, some of this festival. So that's, I'm telling it's you. It's unbelievable. Yeah, and it's just picked, it's just out of the field. The uh, Eden Valley corn travels to about five different states. Mm -hmm. That's uh, that's the demand that we have for it. And I understand it's pretty tasty too, which if you're a fan of corn, you're going to want to make your way out here this weekend. They have corn eating contests. Yes, they do. And just like a corn. Right. And it's, it's amazing yep. all the creative activities they have in store. And don't forget you can buy <laughs> corn out here yeah. too and when we're done with today's show this is all heading out to your local tops market. So this is the local wonderful corn that you're going to find in your local supermarket. And when you're out here you can also learn about all of corn recipes exactly. that you can explore oh, yeah. and taste and see. In fact they're actually going to have the corn chowder and corn bread competition. Ooh, that's perfect. I that hear you make a good up. chowder. Um, My husband oh, makes yeah, a good Bob. chowder. They have a run for the corn and we're going to talk to those folks later. Yeah so make sure to grab your running sneakers but this morning I figured I would take a walk on the wild side. I'm not much of a cook and I'll always be the first to admit this but I did a little research of how you can prepare your corn because a lot of people choose many different ways. Yes they do. Linda how do you prepare your corn? You know I think I like it best um, when we grill it and then bring it Ooh, to the table like the grilling. and then slather it with butter and salt. Yeah delicious. With the corn with those grill marks. So I grew up boiling yes corn oh, yes boiling oh, yes. the corn um i was away last weekend with some friends and they had bought some corn from one of the local growers but they also grilled it too but yeah. first they husked just a little of it right soaked it put it in aluminum foil and then placed it on the grill which i thought was interesting i had never seen anything like that before i remember my mother used to add salt to the water before the corn went in yeah. and i thought she might know something or two because you know she came from a farm then I find out when I move to Western New York, you don't put salt in the water, you put sugar in the water. Oh! Because it sweetens up the corn even more. Oh, I like that. Yeah. But we we have sweet corn here. Yes. I mean, they, they really do such a the wonderful first corn job. Of the season, great. But listen, when I was out in uh, Fort Collins, Colorado, they uh, were putting mayonnaise on corn. Really? I know, I know. And they love it that way. So, That's so interesting yeah. to me. I mean, a lot of people, I understand, they'll microwave their corn. Right, right. I guess if you're in a hurry. Or you can just eat it raw. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if I could be that adventurous this morning, and, but and don't sure it's pretty tasty. And we know a lot about popcorn back at the station. Yeah. So lots of ways <laughs> you can enjoy it. That's right, right. That's all we ever snack on. What else would you have at the movies but corn, right? Popcorn. So throughout the next half hour, we are going to give you the full list, the rundown of what's going to be happening here oh, this yeah. weekend. But of course, before we uh, take a look at our weather. Yeah. I think we have a few uh, corny jokes well, yeah, to tell. Yeah, we want you to remember <laughs> things like this, okay? Okay, here we go. How is an ear of corn like an army, Courtney? Hmm, I don't know, Linda. They both have a lot of kernels. Ah, ah. <laughs> Didn't. <laughs> All right, here's one, here's right. one. Um, ooh, ooh, I like this. What do you tell Mays after it graduates from high school? What do you tell Mays after it graduates from high school? I don't know. Congratulations, of oh, course. Oh, of course, of course. All right. Uh, who is who is Maze's dad? Who is Maze's dad? I don't know. Popcorn. I love that. I love that. Yeah, and we, we've just begun. Well, we've got more yeah, of those. We've got a lot we got of these. Store. But it's a beautiful day. It is gorgeous. And um, I'm going to go find out where okay. all of this corn came from. That's so I'll a great be back idea. in just a little bit. All right. And in the meantime, since we are really uh, past day two of this wonderful event, let me tell you about the seven first alert forecast because not only is the Eden Corn Festival going on, there are so many events happening in Western New York. And you, my friends, have the green light. I was talking to Aaron Minkowski this morning for today. We're looking at a beautiful high of 83. There could be just a quick shower through the southern tier somewhere. And as Aaron says, don't be surprised if everybody stays dry. For tomorrow, another lo lovely high of 83. Sunday, 79 could be a southern tier shower. And that's the only little bump in that weekend forecast. And then as we get into next week, Monday's high 82, Tuesday 80, Wednesday 79, and Thursday 78. And may I say the overnight lows, very comfortable for sleeping. 
right down in the 60s. So you have the green light. Come on out to the Eden Corn Festival.